Hi. Today I, uh, I've been asked for the second year in a row to be a judge for the uh, Mirror and the RSPCA Animal Hero Awards. Uh, I did this last year, some of you may remember I did a little vlog about it. I'll, maybe I'll put a link down below um, at the end or something. It is the awards uh, that recognises people who work with animals, who dedicate their entire lives uh, in conservation and in saving animals' lives and in rehabilitation uh, and in education and, and inspiring new generations of people to to care for and love and nurture animals and also animals who work with humans who have done amazing things from dogs that work with the military and the armed forces and uh, and in care like incredible amazing inspiring stories and basically I'm uh, one of a panel of judges that get to hear these incredible stories all divided up into different categories uh, and we lock ourselves in a room and we have to pick uh, winners, um, which is so difficult, but these are incredibly important awards because they um, It's so important that we recognize these people who do amazing work. Um, it's really inspiring and something I feel very passionate about and I know a lot of you guys who watch uh, this channel and follow me on social media have to share my same uh, feelings towards uh, animals. I'm actually staring at my cat who's just uh, sunbathing out there at the moment after weeing on my sofa. So uh, I'm not so keen on that animal right now, to be honest. She definitely wouldn't win an award. But I, yeah, I do feel incredibly passionate about um, caring for uh, and looking after the animals that we share this glorious planet with um, and so I'm honoured once again to be uh, going down to judge this and actually no, I'm not running late I've got five minutes running to get in my car so um, I'm wearing the same shirt I wore yesterday is that bad I didn't see any of these people yesterday they're not gonna know until they watch my vlog which none of them probably do <laughs> ah, it's a nice little leftover bit of uh, toast chewed toast Right, let's go to London. Here are my socks. Um, wore these yesterday too. Bit of a mess today, to be honest. Uh, I'm not sure if I can film in there. Uh, if I remember from, uh, correctly from last year, we kind of have to, uh, we get locked in this room. It's, very, it's like a top secret operation, this. Um, so if I can film in there, I will. If I can't, just come for a little car journey into London. Lucky you. Yay! <laughs> Listen, all you New Literally got back from uh, from judging the Animal Hero Awards. My goodness, it's emotional. I mean, there are incredible, uh, inspiring, uh, emotional stories um, and amazing candidates this year. Um, and I mean, it's nearly impossible picking a winner. Everyone uh, that is nominated deserves to win. Um, so that I mean, it's really, really hard. And that's why it takes, you know, all morning and a whole panel of judges to, to choose. Do you know what is amazing? There's, you know, a group of people there, the Mirror, the RSPCA, uh, and everyone on the panel, everyone there trying to do, uh, you know, trying to do good and recognise uh, people and animals that are doing good uh, or that have done exceptional things. And it's, a, it's, it's so inspiring and amazing to be a part of that. So um, uh, I'm, you know, incredibly honoured to be on, on the panel again. And... I think we've picked 
some very uh, worthy deserving winners this year um, so I really look forward to the uh, to the award ceremony in September because um, it's, it's lovely getting to meet the people that you uh, that you know we've sat around debating um, so uh, I, I look forward to that so thank you very much to the Mira and the RSPCA and the Animal Hero Awards for having me uh, on the panel again anyway thank you for watching I will see you guys next week good but, oh, before I go, uh, this is not, you know, not, I don't want to add any uh, self-promotion into this video. I just want to say thank you very much to everyone who bought There's a Monster in Your Book uh, because it's the number one picture book uh, in the country. So that means a lot. So thank you very much. Uh, so I'm, I'm really pleased people are enjoying it. Uh, take care. See you guys next week. Be nice to animals. Goodbye. <laughs>